So she and you got an offer a few days back and I wanted to uh, give, give it a few days. Okay. To settle in, see what the community thought about it and see how they voted in response to this. So we could kind of, you know, talk about it together and, and see where, where things are at. So several days ago, she and you got an offer from the world economic forum. What they're trying to do is shape their metaverse policy. So we know that she and you is currently in development of the SHIB metaverse, right? There's all these things that are coming out, all these updates that we're getting, and it looks like it's going to be pretty awesome. So they've come to some of these large metaverse players, whether that be, you know, she and you Decentraland, um, some of the other ones as well. And they're trying to, again, formulate their policy. Now, Shaitoshi asked the community, he said, Hey, I want to hear what your guys' thoughts are because it's not our decision, it's yours. And they went through some voting. And with this voting, you can see that 60, almost 63% of the people that voted, which was 22,000 people, voted yes to working with the World Economic Forum on the metaverse. Now, there was some concern about this, okay? Some of the biggest concerns that people had were, obviously, right now, the team is working hard on getting Shibarium launched, right? That's that's focus one right now. And they're worried that if, you know, Shiba Inu works with the World Economic Forum on this shaping of their policy, that it's going to deter some attention away from Shibarium and getting that launched, right? And... I don't necessarily think that's the case, right? This is more more so like offering insight and all these sorts of things rather than stealing time away from development. I voted yes on this, just so you guys know. I think this is a huge opportunity because Shiba Inu has an opportunity to become the largest metaverse player in the space. I mean, they're working hard with uh, the third floor, which is a huge, huge opportunity that no other uh, player in the space is really going to have. And keep in mind, when Shiba Inu does launch its metaverse, it's going to be right away the largest metaverse play in the whole space. It's going to have, have the largest metaverse, you know, coin backing of anyone, right? Because we know that Shiba Inu is the 15th ranked overall um, as far as market cap goes. Oops, let me get out of the Cardano. And I think right here, if we look at metaverse, you can see nobody else is even close. Okay, ApeCoin would be the next closest thing at just over a billion. And we look at Shiba Inu, Shiba Inu is all the way at 5 billion. So it's not even close, five times their size. And Metaverse is going to be a play that continues to move forward, right? There's a lot of stuff that's going to be done there. And this is going to help shape what that whole landscape is going to look like, right? The Metaverse is new, it's ever-changing. So it'll be very interesting to see how this all plays out. And Shiba Inu price is obviously react well you know to this stuff going on along with the rest of the market but there's a lot of movement right now she being used started to flip towards kind of a bullish sentiment you know over the last week or so here we can see it's climbing out of these depths that we hit you know the ftx fallout keep in mind is still there right we don't know we don't know what else is going to be found out how this is all going to play out if there's going to be anything that comes back to any of the people that used ftx you know who knows right Obviously, you just have to wait and see, but but th I want to hear your guys' thoughts. Let me know what you think, um, whether we should, or whether the Shiba community, the Shiba, Shiba and you team should uh, help the World Economic Forum, or whether you think they should just stay away and focus on their own thing. So, as always, appreciate you guys stopping in, checking out the video. If you haven't already, again, show your support, hit that subscribe button, hit the little bell. Uh, that way you can stay updated anytime there's new content live on my channel. Oh, as always, this is not financial advice. Don't know what's going to happen with the price, but hey, this is really cool stuff to see. <laughs> so appreciate you guys as always. Hope you're having a great weekend. Really hope to catch you in the next one. Take care, guys.